Hey guys, it's Stephanie underneath all these layers and I want to invite you to do a workout with me outside, dress appropriately, but I don't know about you, but I don't want to be inside for three months. Um, just dress for it and join me. So we're going to do four exercises. The first is going to be a kick through. The second is going to be a split squat. The third is going to be a plank shoulder tap. And the fourth is going to be a bridge march. So anywhere from 10 to 20 to 30 reps, adjust as you need to. And here is the proper form and how to begin. Kick throughs, number one. We're going to begin in a crouch position, like so. Get in there tight. And then we're going to pivot and extend the leg and we should be in a nice balanced position at the top. My abs are tight, we're engaged, let's call them engaged. My arm is straight. When you're in this final position right here, arm is bent at 90 degrees. And follow through, you can get a little hop or start slowly. Make sure your foot is flat, not on the ball of the foot like this. Flat and 10 to start more if you're able. That's the first exercise. The second is a split squat. I love this exercise. Place one foot behind you on a chair or a little table. Start with a straight spine, of course. Shoulders are down, abdomen is engaged. And we're gonna create about 90 degrees at your lead leg. Arms can be at your side. And you can also raise them up like so. Big point to pay attention to, don't look at the ground. If you look at the ground, we're gonna start to hunch and it's all gonna fall apart. So 90 degrees at your knee, weight in your heel, and follow through. 10 reps on each leg to start. Sink and lift. Okay, that is the second exercise. Third one, plank shoulder taps. Hands are directly underneath your shoulders. Legs are straight. The wider base, the easier it becomes. The closer base, a little more challenging. When you're doing a plank tap, the object is to keep the spine straight. My chin is tucked, like so. If I start to do this, look at my hips, they're all over the place. We don't wanna wiggle the hips, we wanna keep them locked down and the abs engaged, like so. 50 is good to start here. I retract that. 10 is good to start, build at 50. Okay, so. And the last one is the bridge march. Can you see me? I hope so. So we're gonna place the feet about hip width apart, raise your hips 90 degrees at your knees and raise and lower. Keep avoiding the twisting, you guys. None of this. We wanna reel that in Stay at about 90 degrees with your knees and get your reps in. Great exercise for the glutes and for the abs, which all collectively make up the core. Three rounds is great. Give it a try, you guys. Bundle up and have a great workout, and I'll see you next time for the next video.